through cool. He hit one straight up in the air. He's out. When was that? It was in Dubai when he got 60. Yeah, one of his favorite teams averages 32 against them and at a good click. It's in the gap. Has he got enough of that? Yes, he has. You're right, Baz. He started well on that short ball. The boundary run continues. Yeah, very short. He hit that off the front foot as well, right in the gap. So, not a problem for a freebie. He's off and running. Gone, Bergen. Slower one. Into the space, a lovely little chip shot over Williamson for four. Smart batting from the captain. He looks great as long as he's hitting the ball straight with a straight back down the ground. And it's the kind of pitch where you can do that. It's not a pacey surface. Change of pace, slow delivery and hit over the infield. It's a good regular shot from Shahid Afridi, a shot that he plays well. Yeah, in the slot a bit. Not a bad idea from the bowler. Change it about with a little bit of off cut. Slow off spinner. There's another one. Very good batting. And that's not very good fielding, but he gets away with it. There's Mitch McClanagan, who's just been moved that much finer when they had the discussion there with Vittori, Captain Kane Williamson, and the bowler. So he went finer and just as well for that sort of premeditated stroke. Get the longer spikes on, Mitch. Yeah, he, uh, he slipped, but recovered well. Yeah, I, I thought it was a good job in the end. Gone. Over the rope, yes. Too much on it with a big blade as the captain. Six off the last one means nine off the 39th. It's 198 for five. Well, Afridi's strength is on view when he is uh, playing this shot. Just a flake and knew exactly that he hit it uh, well enough. Because he's got to start. 19 from 11. Yeah, hit it hard. A whip. Tom Latham. Was it uh, Brownlee really making a, a valiant attempt? Slower one, he had to wait. But he sizzled this out to cover. And lucky it's Brownlee again, who is quick. 200 comes up for Pakistan. The charge is on. The next man in, Safraz, should be exciting times for Pakistan because they've closed the distance, even though required rate is still hovering around that 9.2 average. But this is a match that... Pakistan feel they can win this. That's beautifully carved away. How well he's managed that. Daniel Vittori can be a very difficult customer as a bowler. But Shahid Afridi is batted beautifully in this series and uh, this was crafted. Nicely managed. Well, the good thing now for the home side is it's under three figures. It's 95 from 63. So he's brought it back to pretty much nines. Will he go for another big shot? Makes room, goes big, finds the gap. Brilliant. Absolutely awesome stuff from Shahid Afridi. 2-11 for five. Back deep. He looked around the field. The last ball of the Vittori over. He found the gap. Didn't try and overhit it. Sat back, swiveled, placed it exactly where he wanted to. Threw a straight mid-wicket. The four more. 13 off that Dan Vittori over. Now we've got Matt Henry. Third man and fine legger up. Slower one. Oh, he's clocked him in the helmet. It was that slower bouncer. And he's uh, caught one in the face. And he's going to take that helmet off. I think he's okay. It's just that it's bashed as he lost a, uh, a screw or something on the grill. More worried about the health of his helmet than uh, health of his head. 
Oh, hit him on the side visor, on the grill, and then hitting himself with the bat. And uh, yeah, I mean, he's trying the, uh, the round the corner shot, the scoop. That's not the first batsman we've seen to be pink tonight or today. He's the third one I'm counting, Danny. One over mid wicket. That's gone up in the air, beats the man at mid off and lands over the rope. It's gone for six. 50 partnership between Eunice and Afridi. It spoils the fun for New Zealand and for Henry. The banners are out. Pakistan's charge is definitely on. 223 for five. Against New Zealand at World Cup in 83, Zed. Can't get all of this one. Wants two. Yeah, good running. 42 down. It's 228 for five. Can he beat third man? Ah, oh, you know it. Opens the blade, glides it. And it is all happening for a freedom in Pakistan. Well, he's played a, a great innings here because when he's hitting the ball like that, he at times just loses the perspective of finding the gaps, playing the field. In this innings, he's been extremely aware of where to place the ball. The field is on 46. Oh, I got a hand on it. Dan Vittori, all six foot four of them. Won't go for four. But he gets three to go to 49 to win the 43rd. It's 238 for five now. Was there an edge? Yes, there was. Adam Milton strikes and Shahid Afridi goes for 49. What a good partnership it was. 66 in 44 balls. But now it's at an end and the captain departs. Scott Styrus alongside me. Well, he was so close, wasn't he? It would have been the first time he would have had three half centuries in a series. And in the end, he has to go. 49, just one short. And Adam Milne, who has been so impressive today, has his first wicket. And it's the big one. It's the captain, Shahid Afridi. He's gone for 49, as I said. It's 238 for six.